The second race of Formula 3.5 also takes place on a wet track. Bird starts from the back of the pack due to having too little fuel on board after qualifying. The rolling start behind the safety car, it's Magnussen, the rookie from pole position, followed by Freins, Bianchi and Williamson. As the safety car moves off, the going is very difficult for cars further back in the pack with virtual zero visibility. Yololi is at the limit of adherence. For the second time this weekend, the obligatory pit stop will be telling. Here, Magnussen and Freins are in the pits at the same time. Freins comes out just in front of Magnussen, but the Danish driver won't take a line down and attacks to take back the lead. Further back, there's a spectacular accident in the Coombs as Stanaway's Lotus takes flight, crashing heavily back to the ground. The red flag's out, and the race is neutralized while the driver's extracted from the car and the debris cleared from the track. The restart will take place under the safety car. Conditions are more than difficult in the spray and mist of the spa track. Meanwhile, Nick Yololi manages to get through past Frines, who has technical hassles. Williamson is the first past the checkered flag, but only because he was one of two cars not to take the obligatory pit stop. The race thus rightfully goes to the young Danish driver, Kevin Magnussen. It was um, crazy. I wasn't... At one point, I wasn't sure what position I was because um, of all the the cars that hadn't pit and and the the red flag and it was a crazy race. Uh, just wanted it to end, but uh, so pleased, so happy to have won. Comtech Racing's Nick Yololi and second, and Robin Freins third. Sam Bird worked his way up to fifth from the back of the pack. <laughs>